In this tip of the day, I'm going to demonstrate how quickly you can create toolpath for multiple parts. Now in this example, I've already created toolpath for the part in the lower left hand corner. What I've done is I performed a slot milling operation and I've also performed a profile around the outside. Now if I want to create toolpath for multiple parts, very simple. Just take your cursor to the NC manager, double click on your toolpath group, and then what you want to do is select the option here called multiple parts. Now for this example, I'm going to use standard repeats, one work offset. I'm also going to use this option called copy array. What we're going to do is this. We're going to say that the number of parts in Y is 3. And the distance between those parts is 3.5 inches. Same thing for X. Number of parts in X, that's going to be 2. And the distance between those parts is 5.5 inches. I'm going to click OK to that. Now what you can see now is there's all of our repeats. And what we need to do now is set up our work offset. You can type in whatever work offset you'd like, or if you click the little arrow, you can select whatever offset you want. I'm going to choose G57. That looks great, so I'll click OK to that. And that's all there is to it. Now if you look over here in the NC Manager, to the right of the toolpath group, it says times 5. That just means that there's 5 repeats. So you have the original plus 5 repeats equals 6. Now if we want to preview this, we're going to right hand mouse click on the toolpath group and we're going to select preview toolpaths. So here we go, here's the slotting operation on all six parts and now here's the profiling operation on all six parts. Creating toolpath for multiple parts within one CNC is very quickly accomplished, very easy to set up. Thank you so much for watching, I look forward to seeing you in the next tip of the day.